Hi, I'm Kenny Joya. Welcome to another one of my tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to modify the mouse wheel sensitivity in Reaper. Now you probably already realize that the mouse wheel is pretty important in Reaper. We could use it to zoom in and out, vertically or horizontally, to scroll vertically or horizontally, or many other things within Reaper. And we could see the actions that control this in the action list. So let's go to the action menu, show action list, and let's type in mouse wheel. And here we can see the list of actions that control the mouse wheel. We could adjust the solo in front dim, our scrubbing, our track heights, moving the edit cursor, and horizontally scrolling, or vertically scrolling, or zooming horizontally, or vertically. And we can change all this, or the actions that control it, over here. And there's other actions in different sections, like the MIDI editor, but we'll get back to that in a bit. Let's keep it simple and adjust one of the most common ones down over here, zoom vertically. I have it set up on my system to be command mouse wheel. So if I hold down the modifier and move the mouse wheel, it's going to zoom vertically if I go up or down. But if I want to change the sensitivity or even the direction of that movement, we could do it with a custom action like this. We'll go back to the action list. We'll choose that action. Right click it, copy selected action text, and then we'll create a custom action, which is basically multiple actions that could be performed with one keyboard shortcut or mouse wheel movement. Let's hit new and let's paste that selected text. Let's name it custom zoom vertically, paste it in the filter to find that action and drag it over. Then we can modify it or its sensitivity or direction with other actions. We'll type in modify, and right over here are the actions I'm talking about. Let's say, for example, we want the mouse wheel to be less sensitive. We could choose half speed right here and just put it before this action. Then it's going to perform half speed and then zoom vertically one after the other. So let's save it and give it a keyboard shortcut. We'll choose the same one. For me, it's command mouse wheel, which is going to overwrite the default. And now, if I do the same mouse wheel motion, it's still going to zoom in, but I have to move the mouse wheel more or twice as far because it's moving at half speed up or down. So if I want a more fine adjustment, I would choose this. But if I want the opposite, we could just edit that custom action right here. Let's delete this one, type in modify, and choose one of the others. Let's try double, and let's also reverse it. Again, they both have to be before this action. Otherwise, it won't work. But we can stack them to get different adjustments. So now, if I move the mouse up, it gets smaller. If I move the mouse down, it gets bigger. But it's also happening twice as fast because we readjusted the sensitivity in our custom action. Smaller and bigger. And like I said, we can stack this. So instead of doing double, we could choose plus 10% and add a few of them to get 20% or 30% to adjust the sensitivity of a mouse wheel action like this. Goes a little faster than default, 
but it still moves in reverse. Although we could remove this action to keep that speed, but change the direction of the mouse wheel. Going up makes it smaller, and going down makes it bigger. And this is going to work with any mouse wheel action that we have. Let's try another one. Let's open up the MIDI editor on the piano. Now by default, if we select all these notes and hold down shift and move the mouse wheel, we could readjust the velocity of our MIDI notes. But I'm noticing I have to move the mouse wheel pretty far to do anything. To make this faster, go to the mouse wheel under MIDI Editor, choose that action, right click it, copy selected action text, create a custom action, paste it, drag it over, we'll name it custom, then type in modify. We can make it faster or slower from here. Let's make it double, put it before, let's do it twice. So it's four times faster. Save it, add the keyboard shortcut to it, shift, mouse wheel, overwrite the default. Now we can adjust the velocity with our mouse wheel. And it's gonna go a lot faster, four times as fast as the default. So it's a great way of adjusting our sensitivity regarding speed and direction with the mouse wheel. So that's pretty much it. That's how to modify a mouse wheel sensitivity in Reaper. I hope you learned something, hope you can use it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Mom.